G'day, Scott here from Switch Boss. Today we're going to go through some circuit breakers, some of the features to look out for, and where you might be able to use them in your vehicle. We've got a 60 amp circuit breaker here. Um, so as you can see, these have got the, um, the manual circuit breaker as well, um, and they're resettable. We've also got the um, M6 um, stud terminals there, and we've also got a um, like a tensioning um, washer on there as well. So when that nut goes down, it stays nice and firm on the on the lug. Uh, and then we've just got our rubber caps to go over the terminal holes here. Um, for fixing them, I'm going to put two screws through here. Um, these are really versatile units uh, being waterproof, so you can put them under your bonnet of your car, um, obviously at the back of your boat somewhere. Um, and you can also isolate things. So for example, if you didn't want your fridge running all the time, um, you can use this as a bit of a switch and circuit break it. Um, and you can also see when it breaks as well. So uh, if you're having a fault in your boat or your vehicle, you'll be able to see pretty easily if the circuit breaker is broken, um, be able to reset it and find your faults. This is our 60 amp circuit breaker. They come in a 40, 50, a 60, uh, and a 30 as well. Um, yep, we've got them in three different styles. So this is the, uh, the fascia one, it mounts straight onto a flat surface, uh, but we've also got our, our flush mount ones where the terminal um, studs are actually on the back of the unit, so you can hide all your wiring. Um, so yeah, a lot of different options for a lot of different um, environments. If you're looking to get a circuit breaker and upgrade your wiring setup in your vehicle, jump on to switchboss.com.au today.